Somebody asked me what I thought about the bendy thingy me dingy tripod that I use on my DSLR camera. So we're gonna talk about this today in this great, very short, but somewhat detailed review. High five. The link is in the description below. Check it out. If you use the link down down below, it's the same same cost to you, but a little portion of that sale will go towards me through the Amazon Associates program. Isn't that cool? So this, I believe, is what it said it holds up to six pounds. I use it for my DS DSLR camera. It is an ADD with this great lens. And then I also have the Rode mic on it. So I don't know how much this is, just a few pounds, but this is strong enough to hold this. In the package, whenever you first open it, it comes with this little piece that mounts to the bottom of your camera using that. This will flip out and then you can screw it in to your camera like so. Make sure it's positioned like so. This little part, you loosen it right here. Then you take this part, you just slide it in nice and slow, right? Oh, I can do it with my thumb by itself? Look at that, look at that skill. There we go. Now it is attached. There are two little knobbies right here. This one and this one. This one controls that, so then you can go, oh, I wanna, I wanna position it to look up, and then down, and then like that. And then once you find your great position, you can lock it in right there. And then this one controls it turning, which is pretty neat of freedom. So far, this thing is pretty durable. Um, I am a little tiny bit rough on my equipment whenever I'm in the heat of things. So a couple times, this has happened twice now, I bent this part a little bit too much and it completely came off. And it took quite a bit of muscle to ease it back into the hole. And uh, But eventually I did get it back in and, it, and it's fine now. But that was something I did not appreciate. But uh, let's take a look here. Look at this fancy review table that I have. Anyway, yeah, you, you can you can do it like this. Um, also, another cool thing that I enjoy doing, if I, need, if I need my camera to be lower to the table or the ground or whatever it is that I'm trying to film at, you can bend these, and this also gives it a lot more stability when you do that. So it's less likely to tip over or anything like that. It's, it's a great tripod, bendy tripod. I think I first spotted this one on one of uh, another YouTuber's video, and they used it, and, and it looked really sturdy. It's a really great bendy tripod thingy dingy and, it, and it's very customizable for whatever kind of shot that you're trying to get so for this quick review of this bendy tripod um, another thing that i like um, my hands aren't quite big enough to grip all three of these so when i'm like when i'm like vlogging like this i have my camera on and i have it kind of looking like that and i'll just hold it like this that way i can like you know and for me my hands are bigger than a typical females, I think, but but again, th this is this is like a whole handful. Like it's it's I can't quite. I mean, it's so thick that my hand can't quite wrap wrap around the whole entire thing. So I like to do it like that. Gives me better better control over my camera and the bendy tripod thingy dingy. So not bad. It's a great tool. It's one of those accessories that I would say is def a definite must have. So anyway, guys, if you, do, if you do choose to get one, check out the link in the description. Again, it's an Amazon affiliate link, so that's just gonna support the dream. And I hope you guys enjoyed this great short review about the bendy tripod thingy dingy. It's a great tool. If you're a vlogger, if you are a photographer, it's, it's great. It's, and also, it's not that heavy. It's very portable too, very portable. Thank you so much for watching this review. If you guys enjoyed it, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, like, comment, all the good things. Share with your friends, family, followers, and I love you guys. High five. Have a great day.